Hey guys, and welcome to another self-analysis. This round was pretty simple in terms of the prompt, and you'll never guess what rank I got. The prompt was, give a false reason for a true fact, and I spent a bit of time on my response. I was reading a book which took place in Rome, and I decided to use that for my response. My finalized response was, the Roman Empire fell, its dense population was just too heavy. I think it's my best response so far, but let's see what the results have to say about that. Hello everyone, my name is Dark, your fellow Ewow host. Yeah, so I got 105th, which is my undoubtedly best round ever so far, and I don't think I can really top that. So now I'm at 4 lives and I'm really hoping I don't lose them, but now that I have 4 lives I'm guaranteed to make it until Ewow 9. So now let's go to the interesting part of the episode which is the stats and whatever so this time i decided not to do the actual stats part i would just look over all the responses and scores of the people that were originally in the same alphabetical leaderboard board page as me so out of these five which are the last five remaining out of the original 20 I was the best with the Roman Empire fell, its dense population, blah blah blah, whatever. And I got a score of 74.44%. And that's better than 95% of all the other responses. I had a, the lowest standard deviation with 23.62%. And I also got the second lowest amount of votes with 18. And the second best out of everyone was Vileplume Esperantis who said humans are known to breathe oxygen due to fear of drowning. They got a score of 51.58% and a standard deviation of 25.39%. And that was the second lowest standard deviation out of everyone. They got 19 votes and are now still at one life. And Viclo actually had the worst response. They said, this response is a funny one because it's, it is too long. And um, it was... Um, it was give a false reason for a true fact, not a false reason for a false fact. They got a score of 30.39%, standard deviation 29.92%, and they got the most votes with 24. And now, the previous front runner was is now down to 3 lives. View Pie holder, holder of the Pies actually all like just barely missed the mark for getting into the into the safe zone. They said, currently you have YouTube open. I'm watching you from your walls. And they got standard deviation 29.02%. 20 votes. And now they're back in and now they're down to two lives. You like you said, plants grow out of seeds, which determine their randomly generated model. And I think that honestly should have not lost a life. They got a score of 46.47%, standard deviation 32.35%, and 17 votes. And I have the most lives out of anyone on my screen. I hope that you all enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode.